Certainly anatomy can help drive decision making in terms of my approach to squamous cell carcinoma. Small caliber neuron invasion of squamous cell in lesions on the lip always make me concerned. I do think that the decision DX cutaneous squamous cell carcinoma assay allows me to make some better decisions in terms of the way that I'm going to handle these patients. A class one genetic signature in an area that is considered risky with small caliber neuron perineural invasion may be someone who would, I would avoid using adjuvant radiation in because the risk of someone with a class one genetic signature going on to have metastases is less than half of similar patients with tumors of that size in that location.